beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel, Classy Sassy Mains, and I'm Charmaine. So the other day, I had done a video on an unboxing of a human hair wig of Wig She. Well, that video did not turn out. So I just did a little short of it, and I repacked it because I wanted you to see how this actually came and how it came to me, how I received it. And I wanted to show you how it came. So I am just packed it back up and this is how it came to me. Um, it came in a kind of a sturdy envelope, two of them, a sturdy one and then another one on top of it. The box is wrinkled a little bit, but it is a lot better than the ones that they had before. Uh, they had listened to a lot of people. The other ones that they had were green and they had come in and were really tore up. This one is really pretty. It's actually a beautiful box and it has this bow, the way it came in like this. And then it has a little gold showing through the pink like this. But I wanted to show you this, so um, I packed it back up. So let's open this up, and I'll show you the way it came. It came in with the bag that says Wixie, very pretty bag. And then inside, there is a nice, very nice thank you note. and a wig grip with lace, which is also nice. And then some really pretty fluffy, fluffy stuff. I'm gonna set that over there. We're gonna open the bag. Now I did do the short. I did not cut the lace. I just put it back in the bag very nice bag and here she is I didn't even cut the tag off so this is a human hair piece from Wixie when they first contacted me I had been wanting uh, the perfect browns because you know my hair is buzzed because it's very thin on top and I am white salt pepper and black but it's very thin so I just buzz it don't really want to mess with it you know trying to cover up the scalp anymore so I looked through their website and I chose a brown beautiful brown biolage I hope I'm saying that right I've heard it said several different ways it's hard to tell in the indoor lighting. It is kind of raining outside that there are highlights. Now the picture, and I'll try to put it on here, but the picture shows more highlights are seen than you can really see in here. And I'll try to turn this up, but I don't know if you can really see the highlights in this. They're in there, and I'll try to get some outside lighting here in one of the videos because this is not going to be my only video, guys, on this. But this one is wig number 021. If you want to look at Wig She's site, 021, it's going to be a short, wavy bob or a short wavy wig that is biolage brown biolage and she does have some waves to her and she's very soft all right um i asked for a um left part but you can part her anywhere and which i i kind of did so now let's look at her cap she has a mono top and the knots on here are hand tied very 
tiny knots from wig sheet, single tiny knots from wig sheet. So you have, you know, that doesn't make it more fragile. But this is a lace top and you can see my fingers through here. So you can part her anywhere. On the ear tabs, you've got the, the uh, clamps with the combs on both sides. And in the back, you have the other comb, a little comb on the, the nape area. You also have one on the crown. Now, with me having a little buzzed hair, I do have it grown out just a little bit, not much, but they don't bother me. I did have it on the other day. I'll take the tag off here in a minute. But we are here to make you feel like a freaking superstar. Premium topper and wig collections offered offer you a variety of base sizes, colors, length, for sure. All right, so there is a little wave to it. Okay, so I do think that on me, the browns, and the blondes are better than the, my natural color, which is this color. And so I'm trying to go a little bit lighter than I used to be, which is a little better for me. So what I had asked for was 120% density, which this is 120, 16 inches, and a lace top, lace front top, I should say. So this is the lace front top with the wefts in the back, which are covered wefts, which I love. And they do have a full lace cap if you want that. And this is a small cap because everything I've read, and you can put your dimensions in there on your size of your head and I do have a small little petite head a little on the slightly petite I'm 21 and a half and so the petite little petite does fit the small so I got all of that and so we're gonna go ahead these are also lightly bleached you could get a fully bleached but I just got a lightly bleached knots. But we are going to cut the lace off. Now there's lots of videos out there about cutting the lace on a human hair wig. And you just pull the hair back and you can just cut close to the hairline. And then we're gonna put it on. All right, I'm gonna be right back. Okay, beautiful people, I'm back. All right, this is soft. I cut the lace. Now, can you see? Good coverage, small cap. Petite head, 11 to 11. 11 to 11, ear to ear is 11. Little wavy. She is really soft. Now, I'm gonna give you a 360. Okay, so let's talk about this. Wig she, human hair. When I got this in, I looked it up. For this, it would have been, for me ordering it, it would have been $624.99. Now, when she came in, I was expecting the biolage areas, the highlights to be a little brighter, but I'll be quite honest, they're faint, but in the light, you can see them, but it looks like it's very well done. 
like it was professionally done and very beautiful. It's very, very professional looking. So I am very happy with this color. I was expecting one thing. I did get something else, yes, but I'm very pleased. This is probably my favorite brown, brown, brown. I love it. You can see it's not just the same color through and through. It is not. It is absolutely beautiful. Now, human hair wigs, they come in one length so you can trim them the way you want to. So I can have it trimmed up. I can trim it up. I can have it layered. I chose 16 inches. That's one thing about Wigshe. You can customize this. You go to their website. You go on there. You can choose the density, 120 to 150. You can choose your, um, not just the density, but you can choose the length. I chose the 16. And most of the time it'll come in a little longer in case you want to trim it up a little bit. So you can choose that. You can choose the color. You can customize it. I have a friend that had hers customized. She sent in, just talk to them, email, send pictures in, continue on until you think it's right. And if it's not right when you get it, you talk to them about it and they will fix it. Now, I am absolutely in love with this. And I think it's perfect. Human hair is a little different. Now, on a synthetic, when you cut the lace, you do it with pinkering shears. You do not have to do that with this lace. You know, it if you're scared to cut the lace on this, there's multiple videos out there that show you how to do it. But remember, you can, you know, if you're scared, start slow. You can take off more later on. Don't just go in and whack, you know. So you can start, leave a little more, and then take off a little at a time. It's okay to put it on and then take it off, put it on, take it off. Some people cut it with it on. So it's you know, up to you. So let's talk about the different types of human hair. This is 100% Remy hair, but the different types of human hair, this is Asian hair. Asian hair has a thicker density, or denier, I should say, denier, not density. It's a D word. So, <laughs> the denier is basically the di diameter, and so it is very strong, and it will last. It's probably one of the strongest. So, even though it is straighter, and it's going to be harder to hold a curl, it's still got a thicker, uh, thicker denier but it's going to be easy to process. It's going to be um, stronger. It's going to wash better. It's going to be stronger going through the chemical processing. So it's going to last longer through the chemical processing when you dye it, when you color it, stuff like that. So this will last a long time. You, of course, you still have to take care of it. Now, the European hair, the denier on a European hair is finer, it's thinner. Now, I'm not saying it's not strong, it's still strong and durable, but it is thinner. So, it is not as strong as the Asian, which Asian is like, comes from different parts, but um, the European is not as readily available, so it's more expensive. Of course, it's going to hold a curl more. Uh, there's a lot of red undertones in the European hairs that you get. Now, the Indian hair, 
the Indian hair is more readily available. It's going to be more curly. So if you want a wavy part, a lot of times if you want wavy hair, you're going to have an Indian hair. That is going to hold curl the best. Um, they also have a thicker denier than the European, but it's thinner than the Asian hair. So it's still strong and um, it will be very well going through the, it will do very well going through the chemical processing and stuff. Now it's thinner than the Asian hair, but it's thicker than the European hair. So those are the main ones that you're going to see. Uh, the Brazilian also uh, is very wavy type hair also. Um, very fun hair. <laughs> but this is very soft, soft hair. Now, Remy hair. This is 100% Remy. Remy hair versus non-Remy hair. Remy hair means that all the cuticles on all these strands are going the same way. Every strand of human hair has cuticles on it. And all the chemical cuticles are going the same way. So, in other words, it's been pulled, combed, put in a ponytail, and cut and kept the same way. So you know that all these strands have been and are going the same way. So if this was just like done this way and just cut and thrown in a basket and it wasn't kept the same way and it just might get mixed up and then have to kind of gather up and kind of straighten it out, then you might not know which way the hair was, which was the top, which was the bottom. Well, then it has to be called non-remy. You don't know which way those cuticles are going. So you might have one hair cuticles going this way and another hair piece where the cuticles are going this way. The opposite. Well, the cuticles are going to hang on each other. And when they hang on each other, that's where your tangling is going to come in because they're sticking to each other. Well, when that happens on a non-remy hair, it has to go into a chemical bath and they're gonna strip the cuticles like that. So it doesn't tangle. So the non-remy hair is not going to last as long. So the non-remy hair is cheaper than the remy hair. So that's why people love remy hair. So let me ask you this, all these wonderful human hair wigs are so expensive. You can get them online through all these major brands or you can go to these very expensive salons and get all these expensive human hair wigs. Thousands of dollars, right? For Remy hair. But do you really want to pay that? One of the cheapest ones I found online um, at a place that I found online really similar to this one was, let me look at my notes, because I have it here somewhere, $1,925. And this one, if I was to order it today or when I got this one in <clears throat> a few days ago, was $624.99. Now, that other place probably had a little more like, okay, cut it for me. But you probably got to pay, have to pay a little bit more if you got it processed, like cut and all this other stuff. But it's still 100% Remy hair. Um, I plan on, you know, I. I getting another. So do you think I'm really going to pay that? I'm cheap guys. Okay. I, I look for deals. I'm not going to spend extra money if I don't have to. This is beautiful. We are going to be testing this out. I am a nurse. I haven't had any tangles. I did, like I said, the other day, 
I did wear it for a while. I didn't have any tangles. I reboxed it up so I could show you how it did come to me. Still no tangles, so I don't have any cuticle problems yet. <laughs> but I will be making more videos on how to wash them, what to wash them with, you know, how to curl, how to maintain. So far, I've been very pleased. I do have to say that I was expecting one thing on the color. I did get something else from what I was really expecting. The highlights are not as light as I expected, but I've been very pleased with what I have. Pleasantly pleased, surprised, but pleasantly surprised. Um, I do love this. So anyway, leave me a comment. Hit the like button, share it, subscribe guys, because it does help the channel grow. There will be more videos on this. I will have some more information. I am going to have, because I'm a nurse, I am going to have my lab look at it under the microscope. We'll have more information. But so far, Wigshi, I am impressed. You go guys, and we'll see you next time.